Hello, my name is Steve from ccscases.com and I'm going to be going through a demo of our online version. Uh, so the good thing about the online version is it can be used on any modern browser. So with, um, like Chrome, Edge, uh, Firefox, uh, Safari, um, any Chromium based uh, browser. So um, the good thing about that is that you can use mobile devices like iPads, iPhones, Android devices, Chromebooks, Linux devices. So uh, this is our uh, case selection screen. This is uh, similar to our desktop version. And if you've uh, done that before, so it has all the different features of whether you can time it, uh, changing the custom time, uh, simulating a lag time, randomizing cases. So we're going to be going through case uh, 47 today. So we're going to select it and click run case. All right, so we have a 30-year-old female has chest pain after a, a motor vehicle accident, tachycardic, um, having chest pain. Okay, so we're going to start with a physical exam. Let's do a, a physical appearance, chest, heart, and abdomen. Okay, so uh, looks like she's got some pathology in her lungs um, and in her heart. Um, so that's not good. So let's get some... Uh, Let's get some labs here. Uh, EKG, is it pulse oximetry, uh, chest x ray, and um, let's get a fast ultrasound. And she has chest pain, so you usually get troponins. <clears throat> CMP here. So we'll select the 12 lead, pulse ox. Let's get a portable x ray. It's probably more common in a trauma situation with a fast ultrasound, cardiac troponin. Uh, let's get a lactate here and a CMP. All right. So that should uh, give us a good start. So let's go ahead and go to the next results. Pulse ox 87. So let's go ahead and uh, order some oxygen. Oxygen therapy. And that's good. And let's give her some, uh, give her some IV fluids. So let's give her some normal saline. Uh, yes, intravenous. And let's uh, consult cardiology. Uh, patient with um, likely okay. This is not graded, but you know, make it pretty. All right, so let's go to the next, the low voltage QRS, so that's not good. It's all pointing to the pericardial tamponade. All right, let's just do one more here. So ultrasound, uh, the fast ultrasound, like a large pericardial fusion. So we should order a pericardiosynthesis. I didn't spell that right. Let's try again. Let's just try that. There we go. And let's keep going. All right, so CBC looks okay. X-ray, cardiomegaly. Troponins are negative. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, so pericardiosynthesis, um, ultrasound guidance, 300 cc's of blood extracted. All right, let's keep going. 
lactates okay cmps okay they say you we got it which is common oh uh, we uh, uh, we actually weren't supposed to consult cardiology it was that's probably why they said nothing consult um cardiac surgery that's what we needed Consulted the wrong people, which is common. That's why they didn't give me anything. All right, so the patient's feeling better after her surgery or her procedure. And the case will end, which is also very common. After you've done the right thing, the case will end early. So you have two minutes at this point. Um, I don't really have anything else. So we can just go through kind of these are the different um, tabs. So you can go through all the different things that's happened, like the history and physical, what you've done, the different vital signs, um, the lab reports of things that you got, imaging, um, other tests like the EKG, and then everything that you got, the console cardiology. So I don't have anything. I, we can go over some of these features. You can change the font size to be bigger. You can make it uh, night mode. And you don't want to exit the case because we'll lose everything. And then if we're done, we'll just end the case. And a lot of people will ask, where did the interdiagnosis box go? I get that question so many times. So the US only took that out. It was never graded from the beginning and people put a lot of emphasis on that and so they took it out and so we took it out in ours as well all right so this is the grading portion so i did miss a few things um but overall if you get this this you're doing really well if you get a score like that it's probably because i've done this a hundred times so we did uh we, we ordered the right physical exams um i didn't check I didn't check on the monitor when I should have. Um, and um, should have ordered that. And other than that, everything was okay. And then this is your, your log of everything that you ordered. So, like you ordered this. Um, Pull socks. So these are all the things that you ordered, so you can kind of go and, and look what's happened throughout the case. So overall, no. Um, this is a successful case, um, and then there's a summary note at the end uh, that the patient had uh, pericardial tamponade, the different uh, differential diagnoses. And um, that's pretty much it. And there's some things if you want to click it to review later, if you want to do it again, if you think that it, it's going to be high yield and you're going to show up on the uh, real test, you can click that too. And that's it for our demo. Uh, thanks for watching.